Level of detail expressions. Exercise. Customer order frequency. In this exercise, we will write a fixed level of detail expression to help us visualize customer order frequency. The key here is that we want to know how many orders each customer has made and then we want to bucket them. Therefore, our LOD expression for each customer at the customer level, we will count the number of orders. So let's go into Tableau and do this together and build a fun visualization. With Tableau Desktop open, the first thing I want us to do is go to Microsoft Excel. Let's load our sample Superstore data source. Let's bring that into Tableau. Let's take orders and drop that in as well. We have our data loaded. We are now going to click on Sheet 1. So the key thing here is that we will start off by creating our expression. Let's go to create calculated field. And what we're going to do is call this number of customer orders. We'll start off with our open curly brace. We are going to use fix because we want to ensure that this calculation is done for the dimensionality of customer and only customer. So let's enter in customer ID. This calculation will be calculated for customer ID. And then we want a count distinct of order ID. So that's pretty nice and simple. We're counting the number of orders for every customer ID. So what we're going to do now is click apply and OK. Now, now that we have this, let's use this in a fun data visualization that is actually relevant that I have used in my organizations as well. So let's drag this into columns. Let's turn this into dimension. And as you can see, we have these numbers representing the number of times people have ordered. The next thing I want to do is take customer and drop it into roles. So now you can see for each customer we have one value, number of customer orders. All we want to do now, just to really finish this off, you can see it's already showing interesting information. I want to count the number of customer IDs within each bucket. Let's turn that into a bar chart. And let's lastly change the columns into a discrete. So now we can see our nice little distribution curve of the number of times or number of customers with the number of orders. So we can see five is the most popular with 134 customers. The key is to actually do this pre-aggregation to calculate the number of orders for each customer is tremendously hard with our LODs. It is possible, but with LODs, we can create a very simple expression to give us this information. And as you can see, once we are done, we have our beautiful data visualization where we're visualizing the number of people who have made a certain number of orders. So again, have a think about how you can use this in your own organization with your own data sets. But I hope you enjoyed this quick demonstration of working with LODs to show customer order frequency.